Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to iTouch App Reviewers. This is a pretty big video because first of all, Apple sent out their media invites right here. We'll talk about that in a second. But even bigger than that, they accidentally leaked images of their own phone and new watch coming out. But before we get to that, let me go over this first. Uh, this is their uh, invite that they sent out to the media. It says gather around, uh, please join us, blah, blah, blah. So this is it, just this. Some people have speculations on what it is. Obviously, it looks like a home button a little bit. Uh, some people think it's the death of the home button, so it's kind of like black and kind of sad. Uh, they also say that um, this also is their new spaceship uh, campus in California, which is where it's being held, so that makes sense as well. Um, and then some people are saying, oh, it means there's gonna be a round Apple Watch. No, there's not. Um, but moreover, I think that this really also means, I think it's got many meanings, but also look at the color, it's gold. That means we're gonna see a gold iPhone, which if you didn't see this already, yeah. Um, but I, I was thinking of what I was gonna go over for this video before those leaks came out. I was like, okay, this is gonna mean a gold iPhone, gold Apple Watch, uh, stuff like that, more rounded off. Um, so anyways, uh, that is the invite. This is what we expect, you know, new iPads and iPhones and Apple Watches. But Apple accidentally leaked their own freaking phone, the iPhone XS or 10S. Um, but everyone's gonna pronounce it as XS. I mean, come on. Now, all right, where to even start with this? Um, this is the image uh, that 9to5Mac got um, somehow, not really sure how. Um, they were sh th these were shared by 9to5Mac, so obviously Mac rumors copied them, um, but no one really knows how 9to5Mac actually found them, um, but they were leaked by Apple. So it says Apple has accidentally leaked the images. No one really knows wh how or why, so it's kind of sketchy. Um, but anyways, this is the picture. I'll zoom in just a bit. Um, definitely gold. And it actually looks pretty good. It looks better than the gold that uh, we saw last year. So hopefully they improved it a little bit. Um, and people said that this looks like a bulge, like they couldn't unsee the bulge. <laughs> um, but it's just the way that the wallpaper is. Anyways, um, here is the Apple Watch 4. So this actually, it looks really good in my opinion on here. But then like, if you think about actually wearing something that's this complex, it would just get annoying as hell really quickly. But notice right here, that looks just like that invite. So instead of having a big red dot, they just made it a red ring, which I think looks pretty good. Um, and if you look closely, this does not appear to be a physical button with um, whatever. It's going to be like a haptic feedback, although it might actually still turn. Uh, not sure about that. Um, but these graphics look really good. And, you know, you've got so much more space because if you notice, it goes edge to edge. They actually filled it out. So I think the Apple Watch casing will be about the same size, but they're going to fill out the screen uh, all the way to the edges. And old Apple Watch bands will fit. That's pretty much confirmed at this point. I don't know. People have been saying, you know, that this is going to be called the iPhone XS. Not really uh, confirmed. And right here, according to the leaked data, Apple is planning to call both the 5.8 and 6.5 inch OLED iPhones the iPhone XS, which is an unusual choice. I don't know if that means that they're not going to call it the 10 Plus, 10S Plus, or if they're just going to call both of them the 10S, maybe like 10S 5.8, 10S 6.5. This is a very confusing paragraph right here. So I wish they would have kind of reworded that because I'm not sure what they mean by that. Um, but 10s is kind of a, I don't know, it's an iffy, uh, iffy thing, but they couldn't really call it the iPhone 11. And you want to know why this event's being held on September 12th, one day after September 11th, which is 911. If they announce the iPhone nine, which is the cheaper one and the iPhone 11, which is this one, that just sounds weird. So they're not going to do that. This is, um, they're, they'll probably call the other one, the iPhone nine. Um, but this one will be called the 10s. Um, makes sense though. Cause it is an S upgrade. There's nothing crazy about it. Um, can't wait for next year's, but Again, let me know down below what you guys think of this design with the gold uh, and also what you think of this Apple Watch design. So that's all I got for this video, guys. If you liked it, hit it with a big thumbs up and subscribe. I got way more videos coming out for you guys going over all of this stuff. So hit it with a thumbs up, subscribe, hit that bell icon so you don't miss any of our videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.